Hi everyone, this is Shi Zhou from UCLA. Today I'm going to present our work, Feature 3D GS, Supercharging 3D Gaussian Splatting to Enable Distilled Feature Fields. And this paper is also selected as a highlight paper at CVPR 2024. 3D Gaussian Splatting has shown the state of the art performance on real time radiance field rendering. However, 3D GS as well as the NERF, is only scene representation, but no semantic understanding of the scene, which significantly limits the human-centric applications. For example, the model has no idea about the scene consists of a car, a tree, and a building. Recently, the large foundation models have shown promising results on many computer vision tasks, such as image recognition and segmentation. However, they are in 2D, not 3D. In this work, we supercharge the 3D Gaussian padding to learn feature fields via the knowledge distillation from 2D foundation models. Our proposed work is general. Once we have the feature fields of our target scene, we can lift any functionality in any 2D foundation model to 3D without any retraining or fine-tuning. For example, the novel view semantic segmentation by distilling the features from LSEC clip model, as well as the language guided editing. Notice that the editing is operated in 3D space and the car is deleted while the background is still preserved. By distilling the features from the segment anything model, the SAM, we can also achieve the promptable segment anything in 3D using the point prompt or the, bo or the box prompt. If you don't have any prompt, automatically segment everything in 3D is also possible. In addition to the original five Gaussian attributes, the location X, quaternion Q, the color C, which is spherical harmonics for the view-dependent color representation, the scaling S, and the opacity alpha, we introduce a semantic feature F for each Gaussian in 3D space. The same as the learning the radiance field, the training views is all you need. And we just need to encode the training views through the encoder of the 2D foundation model to obtain the feature embedding for each view as supervision. Since the feature embedding often has significantly different spatial resolution and the number of the feature channels compared to the RGB images, rendering them together using a standard Gaussian rasterizer implemented as a CUDA kernel is non-trivial. Our first key contribution is the paralleled n-dimensional Gaussian rasterizer, which can render high-resolution feature map with arbitrary feature dimension without any effect to the RGB rendering. And everything is optimized end-to-end. -end. In many cases, End-to-end -end rendering a very high-dimensional feature is very computationally expensive and unnecessary. For example, the LSEG clip feature has dimension 512, and the SAM feature has the dimension of the 256. So we introduce an optional speed-up module, which consists of a convolutional layer with one by one kernel to upsample the feature dimension. Please see our results and demo as following and feel free to check out more interactive demos on our project website. 